What's up, y'all? Welcome back to the channel where we do shit Colts way. And uh, it ain't always the right way, but we get it done. Uh, today, I'm, I'm going to do a little video on this uh, Built Right Industries um, rear seat deployer thing. If you don't know, there's a little bit of there's storage. You know, everybody knows that there's storage under, under here. But there's also some hidden storage back here that you can access um, if you pull the seat up. So what you do is you kind of just, you know, when it seats down like this, this is flush to the back. But if you lift, if you raise this up, you see that seat moving up so you can stick your hand back there. All right, so back here, there's this little lever right here. So when you raise the seat up, you'll pull this lever up and it'll release it from this right here, okay? So this gets in there locked like that. It locks in there. All I do is reach my hand back there and pull this little lever up right here. So at a better angle, this is the little lever right here. As you can see, you just pull this up and it opens it up. And when it locks back, it just locks back and you just pull the lever and open it up. And then it'll release it from this bar right here where it folds down. What we're gonna do is install the Built Right Industries seat release mount where it makes it a lot easier you ain't got to climb in the truck and lift the bottom up you just pull the little string and it'll drop down you can access this storage right here and people will be like well what are you going to store up under there well i'm going to store this old jib rope line right here you never know when you're going to need a jib rope or a little tow rope i got a strap under the seat then i'm going to put these rope blocks in there too you never know what you're going to have to string up every now and then little handy tools Used to be a lineman, did it for like 10 years, and uh, use these every day, and this come off a jib on my bucket one time. So anyway, it's always nice to have some extra rope. But I'm gonna get this camera set up, and then we'll go step by step on how to do it. All right, so what you're gonna need is a little T30 head. Uh, I got one here on my impact. You can use a ratchet if you want. Just easier for me to use this impact. So I'm gonna take this one up, set it right here, don't lose it. The same one right there so now that this is off there's a little hook under here that hooks up under here like that so you can't really lose it but um, so what we'll do now is well first off this is gonna be like this so first off let's get this through here Come on, Cole. All right, so that's through there like that. Once you got this through here like that, you'll take this and it's gonna slide up on top. So it goes on top of this part, okay? And then you just stick, should have probably done this part first, but so we'll do that first and then it just slides why does that son of a bitch keep popping out? There. So it's in there like that. And now you put it back in here. Line these holes up. It's already up, so I'm gonna shut it and then pull it and it'll open the seat. Let's test it out. Let's see here. So, got our storage back there, and I'll open this like that. When it goes up here like this, it'll shut, and now it's locked in place like this. So, instead of me having to lift the seat, get my hand back down there behind there, all I gotta do is just Pull that up, seat comes down, get my rope blocks, get my jib line, spare set of gloves, and I'm good to go. So it was super simple. I know these things used to come, this used to be red, but they're, they're not red anymore. But So just throw that up like that, good to go. So that's all there is really to it. Um, I've still got my storage under here, um, everything I need. Look at that. What is that? 
Oh yeah, you can't leave the home without the booby fishing lure. What is this? Oh, it's a light up booby shot glass. These are must haves. They stay with me at all times. Here's a little pillow, a little blanket, toe stuff, and that's a, it's a shackles and a toe rope, and this is a, for seat cover for the dogs. But if for chance I needed to get um, some extra rope on my rope blocks, they're right here. Extra set of gloves, hell, I'm good to go. But it's just a super simple mod, and uh, it was quick. So just make life a little easier and get you a little extra storage. You never know when you're gonna need a little extra something. Probably might put some bug spray back there or something too. But uh, look, I appreciate y'all watching this video. Um, if you like it, uh, please give me a like, a thumbs up, subscribe, be awesome. I'm trying to grow the channel. And I'll put a link to this Built Ride Industries um, thing on Amazon. They make a cheaper one, but uh, I like to support, uh, you know, I mean, they're the first ones that made it and there's gonna be knockoffs coming here and try to do it better. But uh, just a small business and I mean, I just, I, it's a little bit more expensive, but I bought that one just cause that's how I roll. But uh, appreciate y'all. Please like and subscribe and God bless.